the song that I wrote Some of the same issues But a long way I have come Yeah, still I need to express my My life, my past, my present, my future, my movie, my God.
just what I need. You're watching and listening to WDIYDS Do It Your Damn Self Art and Entertainment. Here is one of our favorite artists, Kay. This performance is called Crossing the Threshold.
enemy. A drink can be an ally. And other times, it can be the enemy. When you fail the test or simply overdo it. I can't keep failing and I definitely will work on not overdoing it. I don't need any distractions on my journey to falling in love with myself. Ally. Art can be an ally. Hell, it is an ally. I will never allow my work to become my enemy. Even if it's bad, I think we'll see. Inspiration, where are you? I know we are born alone and die alone. I'm still not convinced it's okay to spend so much time alone. Yes, love myself, but right now, I need a nice, warm hug. A body. A connection with another soul, not just my own. Tonight, I will do what I have done plenty of nights before. I will go deep into my imagination, deep into my psyche, and fuck anybody I want. Sorry. Make love to someone I love, including myself. Or perhaps spend the night with someone else for the first time. Hope you feel me. What? Oh, it feels good. Sometimes better than the real thing. I've been wanting you for a while anyway. Now that me and my baby have given each other some space, I'm bringing you to my bedroom tonight. I'm gonna bring you to my bedroom. I'm gonna dream while I play with it. I'm gonna let your crafty crisis. I'm gonna dream about the music and I try to dinner. Cream juice just for two. That's right. I'm a make love in my imagination. Love in my imagination. Falling in love with myself. I write, I type, I text, I email. If love answered my call, I write, I type. Love
answer my call. I write, I type, I toast, I email. If love answered my call, if I heard love's voice, I write, I type, I toast, I email. Maybe love answered my call. I write, I type, I toast, I email. If love answered my call, I write, I type, I toast, I email. Maybe love Falling in love with myself. Honestly, I am sick of it. This note may be exactly what I need. Right about now, I could use someone to relate to. Talk to. Shit, I got to get out of here. Up and give me some. Hey, you across the room, come and 
That was so good, re good. My new muse, what are the children going to do? Thought I'd surprise my muse. After not returning my emails, text messages, or phone calls, why not surprise him at his secret underground spot? I know where he hides his spare key. I thought I'd let myself in and surprise him before his patrons arrived. Why you keep watching us? Are you crushing on us? You're gonna put us in us. We don't need another asshole. Fucking up our soul. No reason to fuck you. We can make it without you. Then we turn around up. After all these years, you'd think a grown ass man would know better. When will I ever learn?
have any interest. So, I will hang out with someone else, you know, diffuse, switch it up, dissolve that motherfucker. get that hump out of my system. If I remain alone, will I really be free? Or will I be imprisoned by me? Maybe there is a such thing as too much space. I need a soulmate right in here, next to me, all the space. What about the soul that walks next to me? Is it the soul? A compatible soul? I think about all the souls I have met, spent time with, been with. I think about all the souls I haven't met yet. All potential soulmates. Think about the mix matches, the mix ups. I should be enjoying myself, falling in love with myself. I will never understand why this happens to me. Where is the peace? Why are my emotions so easily thrown into chaos? Things and people who seem like they are my friends at first become my enemy. Like alcohol. Like that peace. The muse who had no intentions to stay. I consume them. They consume me. Why am I here, trying to fall in love with myself, trying to jumpstart a career? All this soul searching is making my life a mess. I cried all the tears I thought I could cry. I prayed all the prayers I thought I could pray. I wished upon a star, my soul was the falling star. Now I weep, I weep. Lord, my soul to keep Why so much pain? Why so much heartache? Now I know I'm not the perfect bitch Wait a minute, some days I am a bitch It doesn't mean my heart doesn't break It doesn't mean my shell is made of steel 
I looked inside myself All I see is a chest full of tears A chest, a chest. Why so much pain? Why so much heartache? Why? It woke me up this morning As I started on my way It bled into proportions My life is a mess I'm down for the count Tell me who's got my back The Lord up above Has never failed me yet I want so much pain In your heart Alone In your heart Alone In your heart Again In your heart Why? I have to do to keep a relationship from going sour or fizzling? Is it my attention span? My personality? My heart? My soul? Who really wants to be alone? He was the first. I wasn't even comfortable with my sexuality. However, because he was the old freak that he was, he made my body, my mind experience things I didn't know I could. It probably could have worked, but I was young and hooked on his freak. Every time we spent so-called quality time outside the bedroom, I was always looking forward to getting back to the bedroom. We did it. We became friends and lovers. We chilled. We looked out for each other. Nothing was out of sync. No crazy 
crazy fights? Just cool. I'm still not sure why we ended it. Oh, I got restless when he went away to an art residency. I started hanging out with someone else. When he returned, we decided on space and never quite got back to each other. My family keeps leaving me phone messages. As much as I love them, I need space from them too. It's not like I was abused. They would say, God loves you. He just doesn't love what you do. We love you though. If I can't imagine my earthly father burning me in hell for eternity, why would my heavenly father? Why create me, then torture me? Simply because I want to hold on to love in my natural form. Yeah. 
everything keeps circling back to my connection to the other. I still need to be with the other, but I can't give myself over completely. Sometimes my days are foggy. Sometimes the sunshine manages to shine through. Setting the stage for a potential breakthrough. If you are stressed, going about your day, confused, trying to be you,
met here. He's sweet, but considering how fucked up I am, I was supposed to come here, fall in love with myself, so I could truly love someone else, only to realize I am fucked. Take the pain away. He is the one who had me experimenting with shit and giving in to situations I never thought I would. Like he said, I was his boy. For the most part, I loved it. The best sex ever. We would get high, go out, find us a boy, sometimes a girl. Up until then, I had never imagined these type of experiences actually happened. The problem was that whenever we spent time alone, I would find myself falling deeper in love. And all he could do was talk about how dudes suck dick better than females, but female pussy was better than man pussy. I figured I could make him forget about the other dudes, but when it came down to that female cat, my head and heart got screwed. I even launched my own personal campaign with the hopes of convincing him that he should prefer man pussy over female pussy. Thank you. 
I tried and nothing changed. Hated I caught feelings and decided having my heart broken then fucked to death was no longer an option. This led me right into my next phase. I will hold out for true love and not take my clothes off so quick phase. He was perfect. I fantasized about him every night. I even rubbed on his piece a few times. With a watering mouth, I still held out and wouldn't give in completely. Amidst all my holding out, he met someone new who did give in and followed his heart. We still remain friends, and from what I have witnessed, he has a perfect partner. Something I still long for. Stay away forever, then come to me, be with me, chill with me, hang with me, lay with me, embrace me, love me, create with me, stay with me. He's still not out of my system. I wonder if he's the reason why I am who I am. Or maybe I made him the way he is with all my fierceness. Our souls did become one. We spilled into each other. Our aura. Our synergy. Not necessarily trapped, arrested, or imprisoned, but on lockdown and set free at the same time. That's how it was in the beginning. Lots of smiles, laughter, pure happiness. Why is it so hard to hold on to that or recreate those moments and feelings over and over?
Is it a sin to let go of the struggle? Or perhaps forget about the struggle and reside in peace? Is it a crime to find shelter, safety, security in the arms of another? Or simply provide that for another or each other? Look at me. Have I traded my art for the love of my life? Or is my art the love of my life? Are they both the love of my life? Am I the love of my life? What is the love of my life? Hearts. Who is my heart? Whose heart am I? What is a heart? I think I love me. Have I been in love with myself all along? God, do you hear me? Do you still love me? Yes, I hear you. And yes, yes I still I love hear you. you. But and do you yes, really have I still to ask love so many questions? But do you really you have know to ask what so many questions like? You because know you what love feels like. You know what because you are love. Because you are you know what peace feels like. You because know what heaven feels like because you are heaven. You know what heaven feels like because you are heaven. Because you know what hell feels like because you know what hell feels like. 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 Because you know what is experiences have made you? What experiences what have made you? What could any of those feelings? What could any of those feelings? You know how to create You know how to create a joyful noise. Just do it! To hell with the rest unless that's where you want to be! Unless that's where you want to be!
my dream, my life, my past, my present, my future, my movie. Thank you, God.